take the red pill, you stay in Wonderland, and I show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. I can see myself on YouTube, can't I? Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just relax. Okay. okay, just take a deep breath in. Just allow yourself to relax. Like, let go of your inhibitions. It doesn't matter. Uh, so you're here. Okay. Nobody knows you from Adam. What is it better? Yeah. Then, then good. Perfect. Okay, I want you just sit. Interlock your, your hands like this. Uh-huh. And bring them up like this. Uh-huh. Bring them up like this. Yeah. Okay, and really, really focusing on those two hands. Like you have something absolutely precious. Maybe like your two children. In between those two hands. Something okay. precious. So you hold those hands really, really tight together. Now, I want you to bring... You're two index fingers up like this. Right, okay. And really focus and bring those hands out a little bit. Right? Yeah. And focus on the top of those two fingers. Okay. Really, really focusing on the top of them. Okay. And keeping those hands really tight mm-hmm. in together there. Yeah. Really want you to focus on those two fingers. Yeah. Keep focusing on them. And just bring them out like this. And just keep focusing on them because in a moment they're going to touch. Whenever they touch, you can just allow your eyes to close. And just watch them skin in. And as they touch, boom, you can just allow your eyes to close. And that's good. And I just want you to imagine, I really want you to imagine or pretend for me that you have two magnets in between these two palms, mm-hmm. two magnets in between these two fingers, and that those magnets are beginning to lock your hands tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter. I really want you to imagine what the feeling of two magnets seems like. They're a polar, opposite pole. They're going to bring, bring your hands really, really tight, really, really locked together. They're going to lock tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter. Really feel those magnets and feel that tightness beginning to spread up through your hands spreading right up through your elbows and right up to your shoulders and we'll just bring your shoulders up like this like you're saying your final prayer and I want you to feel those hands just locking ten times tighter again locking tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter locking tight, sealing shut tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and I'm going to count from one up to five and as I do those hands and arms are going to lock even tighter so one, locking tighter and tighter but kind of like a steel bar going right down from your elbow up to your shoulder two, locking even tighter now ten times tighter than the time before spread right down through your elbows up to your shoulders and four tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter and five completely locked together and in a moment I'm going to ask you to try and pull them apart but you're going to notice the harder you try to pull them apart the more those hands are going to lock tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter the harder you're going to try and unlock those hands the more they're going to lock tighter and tighter and tighter and tighter go ahead and just try and unlock them but just notice the harder you try the tighter they lock the harder you try the tighter they lock and that's okay and we're just going to bring those hands gently down and as we do, you're just going to go ten times deeper. Relax. You can just relax more and more, guys. And you're doing absolutely fine. We just bring those hands apart now. And allow them to drop down by your side. And you can just gently open your eyes. And you're okay. Nothing to be afraid of, okay? Yeah. Okay. So, I'll show you one more cool thing. Just take a step towards me. Mm-hmm. And put your feet about shoulder width apart. And that's good. Just take a long deep breath in. And take you fill up your lungs. Really, really fill up those lungs. And just release that breath now. Take another long deep breath in, completely fill up your lungs, really, really fill up, and sleep where they down deeper and deeper and deeper, relax, deeper and deeper and deeper, relax. So you just sink way, way down, deeper and deeper and deeper down. And I'm going to count from five down to one. And as I do, you can just allow yourself to sink even deeper now in five, dropping, drifting, descending, down, 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 and four, deeper and deeper. Just notice how you'll only focus on the sound of my voice and everything else just begins to fade into the distance. And three, deeper and further and deeper still. Down, 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 down. Two, deeper and deeper down. Deeper and further down. And all the way down to one, going deeper and deeper and deeper. Relax. And that's good. And now what I want you to do is I want you to bring this arm up like this. And I want you to make it like a really, really tight fist at the end there, guys. Really, really tight fist. Like you've got something precious in between that fist. And I want you to start to notice how this arm is just beginning to lock tight like a steel bar. That arm is just locking tight like a steel bar. And I'm going to count from one up to three. And as I do, that feeling of lock tight is going to spread all the way down through your arm and down to your fist. So one, just locking tighter and tighter, becoming like a steel bar locked in position from your shoulder right down through your elbow, right down your hand. And two, even stronger now, like a steel bar completely locked in position. That even if you tried to remember where your elbow was, it's like there is no elbow anymore. It's just is one solid steel bar from the top of your elbow right down to the very tips of your fingers to the end of your fist, tighter and tighter. And three, completely locked in position now and in a moment I'm going to ask you to try and bend that arm but you're going to notice the harder you try to bend it the more that arm just stays straight and rigid completely rigid and stiff completely rigid and stiff so go ahead and just try and bend it I know you're a you're a strong guy but just notice the harder you try to bend it the more it locks in position the harder you try to bend it the more that arm locks in position and when you're absolutely sure not for me but for you when you're absolutely sure that you cannot bend that arm then go ahead and just nod (laughs) and that's good so notice now I want you to imagine that you're putting a piece of chalk into your hand and that there's a blackboard in front of you and you're going to start to go round and round and draw circles on that blackboard. 
And as you go round and round, those circles are going to get bigger and bigger. And you're just drawing the circles on the blackboard as they're getting bigger and bigger and wider and wider and bigger and bigger and wider and wider. And notice that it's like, you know, like somebody fishing at the side of a river and they begin to reel in. And as they reel in, it begins to pull up whatever's on the end of the rod. So notice that this arm is like it's the end of your rod and it begins to move higher and higher and higher and higher. And the more this arm continues to pump round and round, it begins to pull the arm up higher and higher and it gets lighter and lighter and higher and higher and the more it pumps, the higher the other arm gets. The more it pumps, the higher the other arm gets and higher and higher and higher and higher. And all the time getting higher and higher and higher and higher. And at the count of three, this arm can just relax, but this arm is going to become completely stiff and rigid. Completely stiff and rigid and make another fist. And now I want you to imagine that what we're going to do is we're going to dip the end of this fist into really, really strong super glue. You know, like something really strong, the strongest super glue in the world. So once you just unlock that fist, and we're just going to bring that hand up, and this hand is completely sticky now. I really want you to imagine that hand. This arm can just bend now. This arm can just gently bend. And we can just stick, and just stick that arm to the top of your head. And as I count from one up to three, that hand is just getting stickier and stickier. Your head is getting stickier and stickier. It's just like your hand and your head are just as one completely welded together, completely stuck together. So one, getting stickier and stickier and stickier and stickier. And two, even more stickier now, stickier and stickier and stickier and stickier, as if your hand and your head are completely as one. And three, and in a moment I'm going to ask you to take your hand off your head. So you're going to notice the harder you try to unstick it, the more that hand is just stuck in position, completely locked in position, stronger and stronger and stronger and stronger. It's like glue, just gets stronger and stronger and stronger and stronger. So go ahead and try and take your hand off your head, but just notice the harder you try, the more it sticks. The harder you try, the more it sticks. The harder you try, the more it sticks. And when you are absolutely sure that there's nothing you can do to lift your hand off your head, you can just stand me again and nod your head. Not for me, but for you guys. I know you want to understand how this nose is work. And notice now how we can just stick this hand into another big tub of glue. And this hand can also become stuck to that hand. It's also stuck to your head. And your two hands are completely stuck in position now to the top of your head. And notice, Gary, how ridiculous that is. For no reason at all. Standing in a bar, in Temple Bar, and your hands are stuck to your head. And notice how funny that becomes now. That smile begins to get bigger and bigger. And that laugh begins to get bigger and bigger. You think about how ridiculous this is. You're stuck three hypnotists, two girls, in a bar, in a city you don't know. Your hands are stuck to your head, and that smile is getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. And it's getting funnier and funnier and funnier and funnier. <laughs> Funnier and funnier and funnier and funnier. And all the time that smile just gets bigger and bigger. And as it does, you're just having a great time. You're feeling absolutely fine, totally relaxed. And you're having a great time as that laugh just gets better and better and better. Okay, and just notice how we can just take those hands down now, but they're going to become even stickier as we bring them down from your head. And just notice now how this is still in front of you. And those two sticky hands are just going to completely, you can just bend down now, and those two hands are completely stuck to that stool. It's as if your hands and that stool are as one. The harder you try to get them off, the stickier those hands get. The harder you try to get them off, the stickier those hands get. They're just getting stickier and stickier and stickier and stickier. And in a moment, I'm going to ask you guys to really, really try and unlock those hands, but you're going to notice that the harder you try, the more the stool sticks to them. The harder you try, the more the stool sticks to them. Completely stuck in this. Go ahead and just try and lift your hands. Just notice that they just get stickier and stickier and stickier and stickier. And the harder, the harder you try to unstick them, the more that it is. So I'm completely stuck in position. Completely stuck in position. Completely stuck. Locked to that chair. Stickier and stickier and stickier and stickier. And Gary, you know what? This is freaking hilarious. Like, is it not? <laughs> and it gets funnier and funnier and funnier. And at the time just three, those hands will just unstick. So one, two, three. There you go. And that's good. <laughs> okay, so Gary, you're feeling absolutely fantastic. And now, on the count of three, I'm just going to tip you on the shoulder and you can just open your eyes. You're feeling fantastic. So one, two, three. And just open your eyes and you're feeling great. You're feeling fantastic. There you go. Is that okay? There you go. <laughs> yeah. Yes, thanks very much. It's a sleep, wait You take the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe.